rays and shine, if the Henrik rise and shine. Greetings, Frederick. Who are you? It's us, the Muses, whom you asked for inspiration so many times. Netty, Hypeti, and Messi. We sense that you'd returned. We want to help you. Since you left, no other master has appeared. Dear ladies, I'm honored. I wanted to... Piano, quiet. We haven't got much time. We bring you artifacts of great power. They may not be blades in a chain, but they are also extraordinary and almighty. When you say our names, this carriage will take you to any place in this world. And this is your grand piano. We hid it so that it could wait for you when you return. A pocket-sized one. Ideal for traveling, but when you take it out, it will revert to its natural size. So that you can hone your skill whenever and wherever. Dear ladies, thank you for your gifts. I hope you can also tell me... Piano Frederick, time takes no prisoners. We have to go. Or it might be too late. Something happened? You know, we're appearing in a Greek salad advert for a famous and influential fast food chain. Our careers depend on this. Oh, yes. But... Frederick, goodbye. And good luck. Why am I here? What am I supposed to do? Chopin. You need not have returned. Who are you? You should have stayed on the other side. There's no frequency for you here. Who are you? Jean, the greatest musician in the world. I'm honored. There's no place for you here anymore. I'm sure we could come to some kind of agreement. Okay. In that case, give him. Hand over the grand piano. That's not what I had in mind. Bow voluntarily before electronic powers. Give in and I will leave you with remnants of consciousness capable of feeling something other than pain. Never! Unbending indeed. I have always admired you for that. But still I will process you into a sample for my cyber banjo. Perfect for serenades. Stand for a musical duel. Anything but serenades. All right, let's play. Frederick versus Jean.
musicality. Master, enough, enough, I give up, I tell you everything. Then speak, why did you attack me? It's not my fault, it's all because of him. He talked me into it, the one who brought you back. He said that if I defeated you, I'd be famous again, and I wouldn't have to leave off my pension. Who is this he? Why did he bring me back here? I don't know. He wore a mask and a hood. He said he had a great plan and I would benefit from it. Maybe others no more. He said that if I didn't succeed, there were other musicians. He said he was flying to the world's capital of culture. Wait a minute. The cultural capital? That could be Paris, I guess. Hmm. You're obviously not from this century. Now all the big things are in the USA. He was talking about New York. How truly strange. America? I do need to know why I returned here. It's time to fetch the carriage. I'll fly to America. What a journey! The carriage may have been fast, but rather uncomfortable. I'll spend the night on this beach. Yo, man. Get those bad vibes off my beach. But I'm not sad. I have only been reflecting. You've been humming some blue tunes with a long face. Optimism rules here. This place makes me feel depressed uneasy. It was a normal beach until you landed here to hum these nocturnes. But chill, I'll soon fix it. See old man, it's better already. Truly a powerful effect. Wait, don't I know you? What's your name, bro? Frederick Chopin, at your service. Chopin? You ruined my childhood. When I was five, they told me to pluck the grand piano like you. Have you any idea how I suffered? Everybody played reggae, and I played the piano. But it wasn't me, it was them who made you I couldn't pull any chicks with music like that. Then I suffered from depression for 30 years until I got enlightened. Now I'm like a born again man. Really? No, I still suffer from trauma. And now I'll paint you yellow, red, and green. Frederick! Versus Rob!
musicality.